Hello and welcome to Rick's Kits. Today uh, we're going to start another group build. This one is um, hosted by Charlie Mack. It's the 80th D Day group build. And this is my entry a uh, 1 6 scale German MG 42 with tripod. Um, so let's have a shifty on the box. You don't get the figures, um, which is a bit of a bonus, otherwise, the kit would have been a really expensive. So, what you get in the box is this is what we're aiming to build a whole tripod with the MG gun and ammunition. Bit of a reflection on here. And that's down to all the lighting. There you got the MG42. It has uh, opening to put your rounds in and cockable um, and also change bar barrel. Uh, can't really see it very well. This is probably about as much information as you're going to get out of the kit because it's a dragon kit and it's pretty pretty damn poor information I'll show you. So you've got backpacks, um, leather pattern realistically produced on the backpacks and adjustable legs and all different gun heights. Head up with this light in the system not being able to do anything. So in the box. These are the instructions, I'll show the instructions in a sec. Right, let's have a bit of a change around here because I'm getting a bit peeved. So, this your ammunition. Cans that go on the side. They give you spanner. These are the, um, the machine gun front um, legs. Cut of handles, etc. Mostly, this is anti aircraft uh, oil can. Um, it's for the, the belts. It's fair that it's pretty large, as you can see. So, this is the, this is the main machine gun. There's your two um, shoulder, shoulder stocks, halves that have to go together. Uh, there's your feed tray, your ammunition belt, the muzzle flash, um, that's the actual feeder for the uh, ammunition as it goes through, that is a complete firing pin, and then you have a separate firing pin on the sides, that's, um, that's for the barrel on the side. These are the spe these are the barrels and the spare barrel. Yeah, it comes with a spare barrel. No case for the spare barrel, but it comes with a spare barrel. Uh, everything on this is now um, for the tripod. And yeah, liver effect pads. I mean, there's loads of little bits and pieces, but um, you've got sight and mechanism for that. We're getting all out of the bag here, we'll see when it, when it comes. Uh, two different types of uh, tripod mount. One is um, for this one, which is the heavy duty tripod, and the other one is for um, it's still a heavy duty, but it's uh, anti aircraft mount. These are the leg supports for the tripod. There's the front leg. Um, that's one that's adjustable. These are adjustable from uh, uh, wing nut type clips, and that's an adjustable for the actual frame itself for the legs going out, etc. That's a rail for the sighting mechanism to run around, etc. Uh, it's quite detailed as you expect to drag kit to be, and there's the support frame for the. Uh, the the tripod mount itself so 
that would sit over the top of this. Legs, front legs go on there. And, uh, uh, sorry, front leg goes there. And side legs go on there. Uh, in this bag, you've got straps to make the straps for the machine gun itself. Carrying as a separate item and for the tripod. In this bag, you've got ammunition. And in here, you've got all the doodabs and doodles and nuts and bolts and spring for the cockable um, machine gun. Uh, look. Nuts and bolts and other bits and pieces. Right. And a few and colour decals. The sight range, etc. On on there, you know, probably not gonna see it through the bag. Be too shiny, won't it? There you go. That's got all your sight ranges and etc. for your machine gun. Let's chuck this in the bag. Now I will show you. Now a lot of people, if you've done Dragon, um, you're going to be familiar with Dragon instructions. Instructions are the pits, mate. Absolute pits. There's all your parts. So some you don't use, etc. Gives you all the cool hats on the bottom and all the metal parts in there. Now, it's not a lot, it's one single sheet, and that is your instructions, That's, that is it, that is all you get, you have got to decipher, and, some, and sometimes these part numbers are, are incorrect along the way, so you've got to decipher what is what to make that, and that. And then combine the two. So, yeah, dragon instructions are going to be fun. They're always fun. They're a nightmare. <coughs> anyway, thanks for watching. Appreciate you all. That's the end of the video. See you later. Bye for now.